We may only be in the beginning stages of 2021, but it sure is proving to be a whirlwind already. From scientific discoveries that could impact our world, to some harmless, albeit horrific discoveries, all the way to an unexpected health discovery. All of this and more on today's top 10 list. Starting off this list in our number 10 spot, we have this scary water discovery. Researchers at Michigan State University have been working to try and provide us with a worldwide view on how climate change will affect our water availability. We obviously need water to survive, and we are quickly running out of it, and climate change certainly isn't helping. In an article posted to the National Science Foundation on February 2nd, these researchers announced their discovery that if we continue on the same trajectory we are on, by the end of the 20 first century, the global land area and population facing extreme drought could more than double. This is an extremely dire discovery, and researchers have said that if things don't change, areas of the southern hemisphere where water scarcity is already a problem will be disproportionately affected, and that it could affect food security and escalate human migration and conflict. This study definitely shed a light on a problem that we don't always think about. In our number 9 spot today, we have this AirPod mishap. Bradford Gautier woke up in the morning feeling fine, except for one bizarre thing. When he tried to drink a glass of water, he found that he was unable to actually swallow the water down. He realized he felt a bit of pressure in his chest and thought, oh, maybe my throat is just dry since he had been shoveling snow the night before. Bradford had fallen asleep with his AirPods in, so he went to look for them lost in the bed so that he could get them back into their case to charge. After searching for quite a while, he realized he could only find one, and that's when other members of his household began suggesting what might have happened to the other one. After an emergency room visit and an x-ray, doctors discovered exactly what Bradford's family assumed had happened. In his sleep, Bradford had accidentally swallowed one of the AirPods and it was lodged in the lower part of his esophagus. Luckily, he was able to quickly get it removed and apparently it actually still works despite the volume being a bit lower. In our number 8 spot today, we have this horrible Vancouver Island discovery. One Vancouver Island resident made a pretty terrible discovery recently as she was walking along a beach in Nanaimo. As she was walking, she unfortunately came across a sea lion that didn't have its head. Of course, this is never a good discovery, but matters were made worse when she ended up finding five sea lions in total with the same devastating injury. A marine mammal expert for the area explained that the injuries are definitely deliberate, which means that there is someone or some people who are going around doing this to the sea lions which is absolutely horrible. The expert also explained that some of these sea lions were stellar sea lions, which are an at-risk species, which certainly makes the crime even worse than it already was. There will be an investigation into these discoveries, and hopefully they'll be able to figure out what exactly is going on there. In our number 7 spot today, we have this creepy garbage bag discovery. A New Zealand resident was walking along one day when they came across two full garbage bags. This can be a sign of something pretty gruesome, so they decided to call the police. Once the bags were open, it was confirmed that luckily they weren't filled with human remains, as was the worst case scenario, but they did contain something pretty unsettling. These garbage bags were full of mannequin heads. I'm sure this probably terrified the person who opened the bags when they first took a look. I'm glad it wasn't anything harmful, but there definitely is something weird about this discovery that feels very ominous. At the end of the day, I am just glad that no one got hurt. In our number six spot today, we have this Nebraska semi-truck discovery. Nebraska police pulled over a semi-truck on January 22nd after it had been clocked going 85 miles per hour in a 65 miles per hour zone, and it was also said that the driver wasn't quite in his lane. Upon further inspection, police discovered that not only did the driver appear to be under the influence, his truck was also carrying a few illicit substances. Authorities revealed that the truck had several hidden concealment points which is consistent with the substance transport. Of course, the driver ended up being taken into custody where he is awaiting bail, and the truck was towed from the scene for further investigation. In our number five spot today, we have this pre-approved vaccine controversy. 
Since the start of the pandemic, companies have been in a race to create a vaccine that can help return our world to normal. Of course, now in 2021, there are a few options for vaccines that are being distributed, while other companies are in the trial testing phases to ensure that the vaccines are safe for humans. These testing trials are absolutely critical as there is a level of trust with these kinds of things that is imperative to their success. Well, a biotechnology company recently came under fire after their COVID vaccine called Covaxin received regulatory approval from the Drugs Controller General of India, despite it not having gone through stage 3 trials completely. It was only approved for emergency use, so it's not likely it was about to be widely distributed, but it certainly feels safer to wait until it is gone and fully completed all testing trials. In our number four spot today, we have this real estate agent creepy discovery. A West Virginia real estate agent was looking around a house she was selling when she came across something that literally made her scream. She unsuspectingly opened the basement door and found a statue of a boy, which certainly would make anyone jump at first. If you thought you were alone and opened a door to this, for a split second, I am sure it would spook you right out as you might think it was a real person. Aside from that, the statue looks very creepy, like it honestly could be cursed. This statue with the backdrop of an unfinished basement definitely creeps me out just looking at the photo of it. The realtor explained that although she is used to seeing weird and funny things in houses, this is the first time one has scared her so much she screamed. In our number three spot today, we have this Australian mom's discovery. As summer holidays were coming to a close and school was about to begin in Australia, one mom decided it was time to get her kids ready for the school year. She grabbed their backpacks in order to fill them up with new school supplies. That is when she grabbed one of her daughter's backpacks only to open it up and find her lunch bag that still had food in it from when summer holidays began last year. Of course, this is an honest mistake and pretty much completely harmless, aside from the mom having the horrific task of figuring out what to do with the rotten food and undoubtedly smelly Tupperware container. This mom definitely deserves some extra love after that. In our number two spot today, we have this mechanic discovery. A mechanic's TikTok has gone viral after a completely shocking discovery was made. His username is chaos underscore no but I believe that the account is now private. Apparently a customer had brought in her car to get it inspected after she believed her ex-boyfriend had placed a tracking device on it. The mechanic was unfortunately able to prove her fears correct when he found exactly what she suspected was there. Unfortunately, there hasn't been any update on what exactly happened after they found the device, and I'm not exactly sure what can be done in this situation, but I am very glad they found it and really glad that the mechanic took the woman seriously and really searched for it. In the comments of the video, there were a lot of people sharing similar experiences, and I honestly had no idea that this was such a common occurrence. In the number one spot today, we have Karis Lavert. Karis Lavert is an NBA player with the Indiana Pacers. He was first drafted in 2016 by the Pacers, but was then traded to the Brooklyn Nets, where he played until he was traded back to the Pacers this year. When you're traded to a new team, there is a mandatory health screening that you have to go through. Karis was doing this screening and received an MRI when doctors discovered a mass on his left kidney. On January 25th, he underwent a successful surgery to remove this mass, and it was confirmed that it was a type of kidney cancer called renal cell carcinoma. It is said that Karis luckily doesn't need any further treatment and he should be making a full recovery, which is amazing news. He explained how the trade potentially saved his life because he was feeling 100% healthy and had no symptoms telling him that anything was wrong. The mandatory screening for this trade let him know what was going on in his body and I am so glad that they caught it in time. All right guys, that has been our list for today. Now I'm going to be shouting out some comments. These comments are coming from my video top 10 unbelievable videos that shook the internet. Our first comment comes from James Fry and it says, I love watching spacewalks. I always try and catch them live as they are just so cool. I have just found out about spacewalks. I don't know how I didn't know that this was a thing and it is the most fascinating thing in the world. I'm right with you, James. And next time we are lucky enough to have a live one, I will definitely be tuning in because they are so interesting. Shakira Gaznola, I'm not sure if I said that right. If I didn't, I'm really sorry. Space kind of scares me a little, not gonna lie. I am right with you on that. Space is terrifying. I legitimately don't know how astronauts do it. 
it is like one of the most impressive things because it's huge. I'm cool with gravity keeping me here, not gonna lie. Tyrese Newsom said, I love Most Amazing Top 10. Tyrese, I also love Most Amazing Top 10, and I love you for being here with us, and I love that you love Most Amazing Top 10. All right, guys, that's all the comments that I'm going to be shouting out for today's comment shout-out portion. I've been your host, Olivia Kozlowski, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. All right, guys, that's all. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, wow, I really took a liberty in my presentation of this. That just doesn't exist in the script. Wow, I can't see with the ring light. It's so bright. And why is the sentence hard for me? Oh, this doesn't make sense. This whole thing doesn't make sense. As I'm saying it, I'm like, that doesn't make sense. That also doesn't make sense. Okay, I'm just going back to the beginning. I apologize. Inner number... <coughs> oh my god. Oh, what? Karis Levert is an NBA player with... Brain. What is happening? Thank you.